Hey crafty friends, it's Debbie with Make It With Me. I am participating today in the Team Tiny Hop for October and we will be making a Halloween card. I'm going to be using, this is an old set, Celebration Tidings, and a new set, Warm Welcome, that's got this cute door and little kitty cat and it's just adorable. And then I think I missed it, but I've got, I'm also going to be using an embossing folder, which is um, called Brick and Mortar. So I'm just going to go ahead and jump right in here and we'll talk about a little bit about Team Tiny as we go along. But I am going to just go ahead and get this door stamped out as well as these little, um, their little hands that kind of come together and they're holding coffee mugs or tea mugs or whatever. I'm going to kind of cover that up and make it look like a, just a little Halloween mug. But I want to, my thought process here was that I wanted to, well, first of all, let me say I don't make Halloween cards, but I do make Halloween scrapbook pages. So I'm going to do this card and you could put it on a card front or you could just use it as an embellishment on a Halloween page, which is most likely the way I will use it. So I'm just going to do a little bit of heat embossing here because I want the greeting and the, um, that little flourish that goes up. I'm going to, my plan is to put that at the top of the door. You know how when you get these ideas in your head and you wonder if they're going to come out the way that you think they will? Well, that's kind of where I'm at on this one because every year I try to challenge myself to do something I don't normally do. And this is that. <laughs> so I am going to try and just get this card put together. And I don't know why my video just seems to be freezing. Hmm. All right, technical difficulties. I'm going to pause this and come right back. Okay, so I don't know what happened there. Sorry about that. You all, this video has been such a challenge. I thought I was going to get this done in one take, and um, I had it all looking really good. And then, um, for some reason, my computer program sped up uh, all of what I was saying. So I sounded like I was talking like one of the munchkins on the Wizard of Oz or something. <laughs> and it was really fast. So I'm just going to kind of get back to the video here. But while I, you can kind of see what I'm doing, I'm going to do some heat embossing for this greeting and for the little flourish web type thing that I want to put above the door. And as I was saying, Team Tiny, for those of you that don't know, many of you have been here before and you know that we do these hops every month, but Team Tiny is a group of creators that gets together um, once a month and they plan, I am not on the planning process, but I do love to participate, but they will plan um, a theme for each month. And so we will do, a, um, we try to keep the videos to 15 to 20 minutes um, just so that you don't get, you know, too many. But please try and get through the hop because there will be some creators such as myself that will do giveaways at the end of the video. So you want to be sure and um, watch for those. And I will be doing a giveaway and I'll show you what I'm going to give away at the end. And, um, and I think that you're really going to like it this month. I've picked out some really pretty things to give away. So um, having said that, check out all of the creators on the hop. And then I am going to just continue making this card. I'll kind of have some music playing in the background, do a little coloring so that you don't have to listen to me talk the whole time. And then we'll come back and look at the finished project and I'll try to just explain anything that, that I did. So let's start a little music and um, let's finish up this card.
Okay, so while I finish putting this card together, I'm going to talk a little bit about um, the process on how to win my giveaway for this hop. And um, at the end, I'll pop in and show you just a, a little of what I'm going to give away. It's going to be a little different this month. I usually give away a stamp and die set or a stamp set or something like that. But this month, I just kind of went through my stash and I'm going to do something a little different. So I hope that you like it. But just leave a comment to be eligible to win. And um, please give me some feedback. Tell me what you liked about this video. Tell me what you didn't like. Like. And um, I really would like to hear a little bit from someone, you know, from some of you that some things that you'd like to see on my YouTube channel. I am trying to grow it and promote some of the beautiful items that um, that I get through Stampin' Up! So uh, with that said, let's go ahead and show everyone what the prize is going to be and we'll get to it. And it's called Be Dazzling. And oh my goodness, you all, this paper is absolutely gorgeous. Just look at it. I mean, it's pretty heavy paper, too. But there's so much. I thought this would be a good giveaway while everyone's probably making their Christmas cards. And then I also had, if you've never tried Stampin' Up's, they call them decorative masks. I call them stencils. <laughs> but um, they are just so heavy and thick. And I just love them. So I'm going to give away a set of the basic patterns which I've used these so much. There's this one. It's really pretty. And I've really used this one a lot. This one makes a gorgeous. When you use the embossing paste with these, oh my goodness, they're just gorgeous. And then this one's really pretty because you can make the little tree background. That one's really nice. And of course, you've got to have polka dots. Always got to have polka dots. So I'm going to give away those and the Be Dazzling. So be sure and leave a comment. And then a week from now, I'll come back and I will draw a winner. So please share this video with your friends and uh, help me grow my channel. And you can win something in the process. Thanks so much and happy stamping, everyone.